Jelly Bean Story Page, The Great Chase, Officer Paws vs. The Bad Cats Once upon a time, in the bustling town of Whiskerwood, a gang of mischievous cats called the Bad Cats was always up to no good. They loved sneaking into bakeries, swiping fish from the market, and pulling pranks on the town's mice. Led by their daring and sly leader, Felix the Fearless, the Bad Cats thought they could get away with anything. But today was different. Officer Paws, the bravest and most clever dog in Whiskerwood, had been tracking the bad cats for weeks. With her shiny badge gleaming in the sun and her keen sense of smell, she was determined to catch them red pod once and for all. It was a bright and sunny afternoon when the bad cats hatched their latest plan, stealing all the fresh milk bottles from Mr. Moo's dairy cart. They waited until the coast was clear, and then, asterisk swish. Swipe, asterisk they grabbed the bottles and bolted down the street. Felix the Fearless led the charge with his fellow bad cats, Whiskers, Slinky, and Shadow, racing close behind him. They zigzagged through the market stalls, leaping over crates of fruit, slipping under tables, and causing chaos wherever they went. We'll never get caught. Felix laughed as he darted between a group of chickens clucking in confusion. But what Felix didn't know was that Officer Paws had been one step ahead of them. Suddenly, from around the corner, Officer Paws appeared. Her tail wagged with excitement as she barked, freeze, bad cats. The chase ends here. But Felix wasn't about to give up. Scatter, he yowled to his crew. And just like that, the chase was on. Felix took off towards the park, his paws pounding the ground. He vaulted over a flower bed, while Shadow dashed down a narrow alley, his black fur blending with the shadows. Slinky, the smallest and sneakiest of the group, wriggled under a fence, while Whiskers darted through a busy street, causing a pile of papers to go flying. Officer Paws had to think fast. She sprinted after Felix, her paws light on the pavement. With a mighty leap, she cleared a bench and slid right under a table of sandwiches, hot on Felix's tail. The other townsfolk cheered her on. Go, Officer Paws, they cried. But Felix was clever. He climbed up a tall tree, thinking Officer Paws couldn't follow. Catch me now, he meowed, looking down smugly. Officer Paws grinned. You're forgetting something, Felix, she said with a wink. What's that? Felix asked, puzzled. Officer Paws let out a loud whistle, and from the sky swooped her trusted partner, Peep, the brave little parrot. Peep circled the tree, flapping his wings. You're cornered, Felix, he squawked. Realizing he was outsmarted, Felix jumped down from the tree, landing right into Officer Paws' paws. The other bad cats, seeing their leader caught, froze in their tracks. Shadow slunk out of the alley, Slinky crawled out from under the fence, and Whiskers tiptoed back, trying to look innocent. All right, all right, you got us, Felix sighed. Officer Paws grinned. Good work, team. No more mischief for today. Peep chirped proudly, and the townsfolk cheered. The bad cats were taken back to the station for a good talking to, and Felix promised to behave, at least for a while.